Milk's been my life, all my life. I've been involved with milk. All right. The older people, you know, and, and, and they used to, you know, rely on the milkman. But now it's, things are changing. New people come in the village and they go to the supermarket. My earliest memories of the milk ground was a little boy just going round with my father just for a ride in the pony and trap. I was the youngest of the family. My brother was working in Shrewsbury at the time as an apprentice mechanic. When I left school, I went to a boarding school in Millichoke, down in Cordale, and uh, just followed my father, came home and just followed my father and helped on the farm and milked the cows and fed the pigs. and. We bottle milk, and before we started, I used to bottle milk before I went to school. Well, he'd been thinking about it sort of last year. He thought, thought, well, 65, you know, it's a good time to make a break. And then I think this winter really was the final straw because it has been a bit traumatic and it's gone on and on. Could I, could I ask anybody who's here having breakfast with us if they could sign the card uh, for, to celebrate? This was taken early on this morning before the shots just staggered up. Uh, <laughs> not rubbing it in at all. <laughs> uh, no, it's uh, four pound and six p. <gasps> four pound yeah. and six p. <laughs> Lovely. Hang on a sec, I'm going to have to herd the dogs in. That's all right, I'll hold the dog in. Yeah, I won't let the dog. Come on. Oh, thank you very much to you all. All the very best for your customers. And you. Yeah, all right. Yeah, OK, though. Bye bye. Bye bye. Take care. <laughs> One of my customers moved from Walsall, and uh, there was another. Uh, house up the road and they came from Walsall and the one husband died and I said to the lady down the road, well, the chap up there lives at Walsall. So they got together and they got married. So I had the blame for that. <laughs> well, thank you for your customs, Eric. All these, all these happy years you've been friends as well as customers. You are lovely. Yeah, thank you, Derek. Have a great retirement. I will, yeah. Okay, yeah. Bye-bye. Food. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> for each a jolly good fellow, for each a jolly good fellow, for each a jolly good fellow. You'll have me crying in the for each a jolly good fellow. For he's a jolly good fellow, for he's a jolly good fellow, and so say all of us. Well done, John. <laughs> oh, thank you. Nice surprise. Nice surprise. Well done, John. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Come in in the middle of us. Don't forget, don't forget I take you. I need you some milk bottles. Oh, I've got some milk bottles here if you want a gold one. Oh, lovely. There you are. Congratulations, John. Oh, lovely. Brian. I hope you're not trying to this one. You have a gold top. Yeah. <laughs> 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 OK, John, bring yourself closer to me. Keep coming, keep coming, that's it. Turn yourself in just a little bit more towards the... Uh, that's it, towards your left. And bring the uh, milk bottles up nice and high for me so we can see them. Anybody else? <laughs> Come on in, get in, Trevor. Come on in. Just take a step away for me. And look straight towards me. Now, after three... Now after three, you've gone one, two, three, and I want everybody to cheer for me, OK? One, two, three. <laughs> Yay! Perfect. One more of those, very quickly. Okay. One, two, three. three. Yay! Well, we moved here about um, three and a half years ago, and, yeah, we've known him ever since then. And it's been great having the milk delivered to the door, actually, because of the children. They just get through it like anything. He's always there before breakfast. <laughs> yeah, he does, doesn't, do, doesn't do a bad job. It's come all weathers, I think that's a great thing. 
And some days we've run short and I've been chasing him down, down the road in my pyjamas. So not, not many men have seen me like that. We're at 6.70. There you are, darling. I was in credit as well last week. You were, right? <laughs> Time in 11 years. Your cake, your cake. Oh, sorry, yes, a cake. He doesn't right. want cake yet. No, 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 but let, let, let me see it. Oh, no, he can, he can, he can take it. Take I've got, it away I've got better things than cake here. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> I've it. Well, yeah, I can't. <laughs> Well, thanks a lot, John, from all of us for, for serving uh, us for so yeah. many years, for getting me up in the morning and other people too. Uh, and it's been great to sort of have you not just as a, as a milkman, but as a dear friend. Your old friends, every one of you. And, uh, you know, we've shared a lot yeah. over the years. Yeah. Everybody's friends, they're not customers, everybody's friends. Yeah, yeah, and you so they, Yeah, day, that's right. As long as they get your money in, I'm not worried. I know. <laughs> Down to the last penny. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> Well, Chris's mum's had him for 40 years. She was, she's, he's been her milkman for 40 years. And I think once he was late and he was poorly, and that was in, in 40 odd years. So, very, very reliable man. A household treasure, really. This is the very first milk book I think my father had. Every, I think every customer had a milk book of their own. And they used to put put uh, what, what milk they had in them, and I suppose at the end of the week, they knew what they had. When the milk round started, it started outside MP Jones's shop with a milk churn, when he was a young lad, I expect, and, and they used to deliver night and morning, go, to go down and de deliver so much at night and deliver again in an afternoon. And uh, they used to have bee stings, which I don't suppose you know what bee stings is. Well, that was the first milk from the cat cows calving, colostrum, and they always to make uh, custard puddings out of them. They loved it. <laughs> it's all this slimming now, isn't it? Hardly ever sell whole milk now. It's all semi-skin. Well, I drink plenty. We have cream, don't we, and ordinary milk. <laughs> Full milk. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you're not doing too bad. <laughs> <laughs> you invented BBC Did I, uh, 24 News. Lovely. Yeah. So yeah. I think you should be on some uh, <laughs> sort of commission. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think you've just got to enjoy yourself, mate. That's it. Yeah, you've worked hard. Yeah. Mm. Well, I'll rephrase that. Yeah. You've been... You've been Loyal. Yeah. Commission. Loyal. <laughs> 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 yeah. Hey, have you put more pay in your book? I haven't done it. I'd better take you off here. Yeah, take it off. Hey. Do that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, where's the magic wallet? Show me the magic wallet. What's this? Five and gone, gone, gone. <laughs> <laughs> if you look after them for me. Yeah. I got my van. John walked in first morning, said, Milk, you'll need some milk, and promptly walked in and put it in the fridge. <laughs> so he thought, What sort of guy is this? <clears throat> he even knows where your fridge is, never mind anything else. Uh, and then that friendship stuck up and. Uh, and he's advised us and this, you know, where to get that from, and so yeah. he's been absolutely uh, tremendous. I wouldn't tell him to his face. So. All right. I think for the village, he's been a great guy. You know, when you think of all the things he's done, and all the elderly that he pops in to see, he's a social worker, really, and, you know, I think the milk was just. It's become a sideline, really. John, one, one pack, please. OK, Anita, I'm coming. Lots of little jobs I've done over the years. Posting letters and you are the best, yeah. put this light bulb in and things like that. Found people collapsed in the house and, and got the police in and the doctor, you know, rung the police and they've got the doctors in and the ambulance. And, and uh, one or two, well, I had one person, she had a stroke standing in front of me, and we carried her in the house, you know, and got the doctor and things like that. And another person, she fell out of her wheelchair, and we were going round in the snow, and only for me and, and somebody else going there, I don't think she would have lasted in the, the night. Got her, got her in, out of her, and picked her up out of her wheelchair. You're going to leave us now, then, oh, John. Yeah, I. Uh, you come to meet us at the gate. Good on right you. Right all, right Thank all. you very much, and for your costume. All the very best to you. you. Yeah, and we'll see Hello. you around. Ta -da, then. Bye bye for now. Ta 
Yeah. You there, Doreen? Where are you? All right. Thank you, John. There you go. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. All the best to you. I'll All see you around. We'll come and see you. All the best. All these kisses. I'll never get over it, Doreen. Will I? <laughs> you want to get hey? over it, John? I won't get over it. One of my old customers, this oh, is. Here. 1969. 1969. You've been having milk, have you? Yes. Yeah, yeah, good on you. That's it. <laughs> Lovely. Well, I'll come and see you, don't worry. Yeah, it's all right, John. I'll see you. Yeah, I'm all right. Sorry to see you, I know you are. Anyway, it's nice to see you. Ta da! Ta da, John. <laughs> I first knew John when I'd first come to the village, and that would be in November 1979. And as we moved in with a hire van, who should follow us in but John and his milk float. And he said, moving in? I said, yes. He said, do you want the milk? I said, well, we've got to get it from somewhere, so you might as well leave me a pint now, and he, and, uh, which he did. And from then on, every day, except Sundays, that I've had a bottle of milk off John. Got a bag of peas on, yeah? Like everybody else, they have their ups and downs, but I've never seen him really grumpy. And since 78, when I first met him, we've never had a crossword. He's always been a little bit jovious. We pull each other's leg. Put it on with the milk. Multi multi purpose, is it? Yeah, multi purpose, he's having. Yeah. <laughs> oh dear. There you go. Smash it. Thank you very much. Yeah, you're lovely. Thank you very much. Cheers. All right. Yeah. Come on, then. I'll right. stick it on the back of you, yeah? yeah. You stick it on top of... Oh, hang on. On the, top of the milk. Stick it on top of the Stick eggs. it on the bottom of there. Put it flat. There you are. Lovely. Uh, this the job is out of the way. Excellent. Then. Thank you, Jeff. Right on, right, Bob. Okay. Take you. care now. I'll try my best. That's it. I'll try my best. <laughs> <laughs> John's better than the Daily Mail, Daily Mirror, or even the Shropshire Star, because local news travels fast via John's newspaper. <laughs> hey. Oh, I, I tell you, I've had my van twice and more pop the milk. <laughs> anyway. Milk out. Hello, John. Hello, Graham. Hello, sir. All right, mate. Not too bad, thanks. How are you? All right, how are oh, you? Not too bad. Last Back day on. today. Ah, my last day, yeah. We shall miss you. Oh, I guess you will. Yeah. Definitely miss well, you. Well, yeah, I guess you will. It won't be the same without no. you coming. Well, no. Great. No, it's been a long time, isn't it? It'll be brilliant. Anyway. Uh, oh, thank, thank you, Graham. You, thank you, Sylvia. It's very much appreciated. Thank you, John. Yeah. Very, very much appreciated. You. Yeah. Sit and relax and enjoy it. Yeah, yeah do smash that. it. Thank yeah. you very much. Anyway, well, I'll press on. Yeah, OK. Yeah, OK. Ta-da. Ta-da, both. Ta-da, mate. Hi, Peter. And Derek. Hi, John. You're right. Too bad. Thanks. Yeah. Good man. Thank you very hey, much. Well, Lovely. Oh, you, and you. Yeah. Excitement. Thank you very much. Yeah. I've enjoyed coming. I'll come and have a meal with you now. I've got well, a bit of time. Come and have one on us, John. Oh, you and that's nice of you. We'll come one, one day in the week. Ah, you can yeah. Come, mate. Thank yeah. you, Derek. That's All very, best, very nice of you. All right then. We'll see you. All right, Reg. I'm going to miss it very much. I am going to miss it. Morning, Nick. There you are. That's it. And you? Yes. yes. Lovely. All That's the it. very best. Thank you very much to you both. And Have a really good Come keep an eye on you. I miss the people. Bye bye. You know, the everyday same people. Welcome. Last one today is 290. 290? Yeah. Keep that, oh, thank you very much. Yeah. All the best all, to all you. All the best to yeah. you. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah. I will miss it very much. But life's got to go on, isn't it? Life's got to go on and we can have a bit of relaxation and, and do what we want to do now. I think we're paid up. Oh, you have? Yeah, you have. Yeah, I have, yeah. <laughs> I, no, my, oh, you don't want to take, no, it, I like it oh, twice. Wait, take it off me twice. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just check it, just check it. Now. Lovely. Yeah. It's been a good life. 
brilliant. <laughs> 50 years, I never, didn't think I'd ever be on that one for 50 years, but I just kept going and kept going and kept going. All the best and wishing all the, all the best to you there. Take care. Yeah, bye-bye. How many more to do, John? That's only Mary. That's the last then. That's the last. She wants a red one, I think. Two. Hey. Oh, that's really sad. You were my last customer. Oh, I am sorry. I will, oh, never mind, Mary. You go, you go back a long time. Oh, that's really sad. Is it, Mary? Yeah, oh, yeah. Dear, never I mind. Don't, well, I don't feel like smiling. I feel no. more like crying. Well, <laughs> Mary, my father, yeah. uh, in, the, in the army, in yeah. the land army. I was in the land army. You were in the land army, yeah, that's that, right. 1946, I think that's I was right. taken. That's right, yes, and, and I was at your house that's when right. you was born. That's right, you yes, were there when yes. I was born. <laughs> That's it. Yeah. I was born on a Good Friday. I was two and a half pounds. I was, I was a twin, got a twin sister. Born on a Good Friday, they didn't think I'd live. And I was christened on an Easter Sunday. So I thought, well, what's better to finish on an Easter Saturday? Couldn't work out better, could it? <laughs> Thinking about it, the last painter since 1960. It's a long time since I started. It is, so life's got to go on, yeah. Yeah.